Greetings, friends. In this video, I'll show you how to make FIFA 22 with good quality in a simple way, so watch it and copy what I'm doing. First of all we will make some changes in the NVIDIA control panel. Image sharpening allows you to increase the sharpness, detail, or clarity of images in games and applications. Anisotropic filtering is a technique used to improve the quality of textures applied to the surfaces of 3D objects when drawn at a sharp angle. Enabling this option improves image quality at the expense of some performance. You can choose either to let the application determine the anisotropic filtering settings, turn anisotropic filtering completely off, or select from a number available settings. Higher values yield better image quality while reducing performance. Anti-aliasing mode allows you to control how NVIDIA anti-aliasing is applied in your 3D applications. Enhance the application setting, with the settings specified under anti-aliasing setting, provides the most reliable and highest quality anti-aliasing support if you want to use NVIDIA's anti-aliasing with applications that have built-in anti-aliasing controls. Texture filtering. Quality allows you to decide if you would prefer performance, quality, or a balance between the two. The NVIDIA control panel will make all of the appropriate 3D image adjustments based on your preference. Vertical sync allows you to control vertical synchronization mode, where the application's frame rate is synchronized with the display refresh rate in order to eliminate tearing. Fast sync improves latency without introducing tearing. Available on Pascal and later GPUs, on single GPU configurations. It is recommendable that your computer is able to perform these modifications. You can change these settings according to your personal desire for more lighting and colors. <laughs> 